All right. That love Clark. And um, I'm coming at you with a little bit of information to let you know that yes, I made a video. So go to hell with Jesus. And I meant it. Because if you follow uh, the twisted, perverted Babylonian Bible version you're getting conned by, you will in fact be led down the road of pagan Babylon worship, including multiple gods' names hidden in your own Bible and prayers. Okay? You gotta understand where you got, where the Protestants got all their information from. The whore. The Catholic whore. Roman Catholic whore. Okay? And the Protestants are the little whore daughters that are prostituting themselves out, and they've been kicked out of their house by their mother, and they have a father, and his name is Satan. Okay? Have a nice day. Go worship your Zeus. Go worship your Baal, Lord Baal. Go worship your Amen because you cancel your prayer out right there with that Amen, brother. You know, why don't you go look up what Amen is and the origin, how it got being used. Do you think that um, it's appropriate? Come back with the answer. Tell me that. I know what Amen is. It's Amen. It's Amen. Amen Ra. Anyone that knows anything about anything can tell, knows that. So, actually not really, because most people don't give a shit. But I do. Alright. So, I came here in love, and I want to teach a lesson. And I teach it my way to my people, the people that like me. People that understand me. F all you haters that just want to hate. Because, you know, you want to call me all these names. That's what happens. I'm not going to let it bother me. And, by the way, I think it's funny. <laughs> it's very entertaining. Because <coughs> most of the time you're jealous. But you're just not as open, honest, and outright as I am. And I never can be. Because you'll always be a punk hiding behind your PC fucking little curtain. Woo! And then you can go vote for Hillary or Donald and get all rowdied up for your for your WWF freaking style voting now. You, you could carry hacksaws. Might as well carry a hacksaw uh, to the voting booth because it might be a rumble. No, uh, honestly... You could, you could really, you know, you could really get a rumble uh, coming. So, that too. Uh, this video is also just like going to be some random baloney, ba 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 uh, not Babylon, just not baloney, just, you know, well, my middle name's Tony. So, uh, yeah, I'm Tony Baloney, okay? Full of macaroni, all right? No, but really. And this goes out to Mrs. What's uh, I don't know how to say your name. Moultrie, 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 Moultrie. I'd say Moultrie, Moultrie, M-O-U-L-T-R-Y. I think that's how you spell it. Yeah, she's pretty cool. You're pretty cool. We like you. We like you, and um, we want to help you learn more about Yahweh and God. Okay, that's all we want to do. So. I know that you have a very strong opinion, and it's probably hard to crack your system because you are uh, one of the wiser ones that actually grew up. Maybe you know, even though you, there's a kid at heart, I could tell because you won't play it, play around on YouTube. Anyway, enjoy your free time. But uh, you know, um, honestly, I, I'm reaching out to people like you, um, and. Uh, people that just don't know this stuff and don't haven't been exposed to a lot of uh, some kind of like in-depth teaching you know
from a, a different kind of uh, perspective um, where you're not getting a Catholic uh, watered down sun worship. Uh, you're, we're trying to, uh, well, I'm trying, I was trying to restore original Christianity and then. I found out some things about the word Christian and how it evolved and, 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 and uh, what it is today, who claims to be Christian today, and all the falsehoods in it. And you're probably a traditionalist peoples too, you know, of course we are. Trying to get rid of Christmas and Easter and, uh, and stuff isn't easy. Uh, hmm. But other than that, that was kind of like uh, all of a sudden it's just a shout out to you and people like you that you know want to have a voice but remember this like I said this election thing it's rigged it's a hundred percent rigged it's a show it's a show it's a show a show it's a show it's a show okay it's a show it's an act you know why they have to I'm telling people, I keep telling people this. The reason why this one has to be so divided is to make you convinced that it's real. Because if you get involved like WWF with your favorite wrestlers, you'll be holding up your signs and everything, but it's prescripted crap. And I guess like Fascist Lemming said, uh, I guess he's going to, is he teleprompting now? Is that what you said? Anyway. Hit me back on that if you want to, if you see this video. Uh, if not, someone else, it doesn't matter. There's probably a million other people that know. Uh, yeah, so that, and uh, because, you know, look, they want to give you the businessman now, okay? That's the businessman, okay? The businessman Act and the Wicked Witch of the East Act. Uh, you know, um, with the polls, though, the problem is with the polls, if they don't direct the people the right way, then the people will go to vote, and it does not go the way that they expected. They're going to get outraged. There could be rioting. There could be rioting before or after. There could be rumbles at the, uh, the voting polls. I'm not saying that, that it is. I'm just trying to figure out what, well, what was that noise? Anyway, uh, oh, what the hell is that noise? No, there was a, some cracking sound, I don't know what it was. Anyway, the wind's blowing around, you know. Whoa, what the heck was that noise? Anyway, so, rambling on. So, this guy, okay, Donald Trump. And Hillary Clinton, they are both on the same team. No matter what, will ha when, no matter what happens, they keep it in the family somehow. I don't know how the Clintons are related into the family, but there is some somehow. There's a connection. Um. Yeah, and uh, so. Donald Trump, you know, and then they want to puff him up as not part of the cabal. You know, he's not part of the secret society. He is very, very much so. In fact, uh, of course, he is. Uh, you know, skull and bones and all that, okay? And, you know, uh, free society deserves, uh, deserves everyone else, okay? If the majority rules in a democracy with this free society, how come we don't get to pick these people? How come other politicians, asshole, idiots pick them for us? Because we don't really pick these people. And then they're going to say, well, not enough of you get involved. Or well, when we get involved, guess what you call that? A riot or something. Because people don't know how to get involved. Because you guys are so screwed up, the government that everything's a freaking battle now you know and then on top of that you got all your false flags please moms and dad, dads and everyone that's worried about these attacks 
a lot of these t attacks. It's coming clear to a lot more people, not just these uh, tinfoil hat people. You, you know, these people are gonna. It's gonna happen. Okay, what I'm telling you is gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. All right. So, uh, let's see. One, four, eight. Uh, let's see. Now, one, uh, one, four, one, one thing we want to talk about is uh, also is uh, the fact that Hillary hired Trump. Okay, Hillary hired Trump. What do you think about that? Huh. <laughs> he, <coughs> but uh, the funny thing is, people getting riled up about it and it's WWF man I'm, I'm telling you these things are rigged even Donald Trump himself said it's rigged because he has to go that far now with convincing people that he's not part of the cabal or not it's that it's not going to be rigged for him as well as it would be for her see so he's got to convince those people there's still a there's that voting is real keep convincing them because I'm not convinced if it maybe the first vote was real but I wasn't there did you sign the Declaration of Independence because I wasn't there to sign it all right so I love Clark think about all this kind of stuff you know you gotta think 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 all right <laughs> anyway I'm just having fun this time all right, so I'm just kind of blowing a little steam and letting these people know that yes, I made a video about go to hell with Jesus because with your Jesus because that's what you're gonna go if you start following this Jesus when they say his name is holy, which is another pagan name. Okay, set apart is what holy is. Okay, so he's a set apart. He's part of the set apart. Okay. And, uh, you know, when you say that, and his, it, when he says his holy or set apart name, okay, that you should come in, that gives you power. They even say power in the name, power in the name, they sing it, power in the name of Jesus, okay? Uh, it's, okay, and let me, de let me demonstrate something for you guys. This is not a declaration, okay? But... Here, all right? Jesus is, I confess that Jesus is my Lord and Savior. Oh, uh, 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 Get real. Because I don't believe that. Because I believe in Yehosha. So I just proved Paul wrong right there. Paul's a liar. Find out, figure it out. Paul's a liar.